to even though women have made many strides in the ownership of the workplace over the last several decades, they still face several challenges. That's why a group of women came together today in Sumter to encourage others who are looking to start a business or have success in the workforce. News 19 Sam Perez explains. Empowering women. That's why 145 women and two men gathered today at Alice Drive Baptist Church. There's a movement really going on here in Sumter. Aisha Farmer served on Wednesday's See Her Empowered or She panel. Farmer spoke alongside three other female business leaders in the community like Michelle Logan Owens about what it means to be a woman in the workforce. It's disappointing that we're in 2022 and we're still having to have conversations about gender equality in the workplace. Um, but it is a real challenge that we face each day. And so I think we all have an obligation to bridge the path or to create the path for our daughters to come along so they don't have to face some of the same struggles we have. Kim Hatchell serves as board chair for SHE. About a year ago, she and other members came up with the idea. Women have unique needs in the workforce and really even in personal lives, we have a lot more to balance and we need support from each other. This panel was the first in a series that will be hosted by the Sumter Chamber of Commerce. Ida Solomon is a Sumter resident who attended the panel. I think every woman here um, has been left with something that will inspire her to go to the next level. Panel moderator Erica Williams agrees. For such a huge turnout for the community, I think it's it's dynamic and it speaks volumes about the thirst for information here, um, the thirst for women to grow and blossom in their businesses and their respective areas because they want more, they need more, they want to do more. For Street Squad Sumter, I'm Sam Perez.